there's a feature in Safari 4 that I hadn't noticed in previous versions. Um, it's quite useful for helping you analyse the CSS that's influencing a page or even just look at the HTML under a page. Um, you access the feature by going to the Preferences menu and over in the Advanced Settings there's a small easy to miss checkbox Show Develop in Menu in Menu Bar. As soon as that's turned on a new menu turns up in Safari. Now for me Although there's plenty of options in there, the most important option in the new develop menu is this show web inspector. And if I choose that, we have a, uh, a little um, outline view of the HTML making up the page. And over on this side, we've got the styles that are affecting it. You can um, spring open the outline view so you can see the various bits of the page. And you'll notice that as I'm taking my cursor over the top of them, Let's just see if I can expand this here. And you're getting highlighted the areas in the page, so it's quite helpful for analysing where things are in a page. If I come down a little bit further, you can find that I can even uh, come in here and adapt the HTML so I can see what it would look like if it was different in there. And then if I just tap enter, you can see it's updated the preview. Of course, that hasn't uploaded it to my web server, but it's, uh, it's an amusing little thing anyway. And over on this side, we've got the styles that are affecting that particular selection at the moment. So there we've got a path to the style sheet. There we've got the style rules which we're making the various effects happen. And if I come along here and click onto a style rule, say, and uncheck this box, then we can turn on and off the rule. Or again, I can come in here and edit it. And just see what the effects of that might be. All in all, a very useful little tool, I think.